Hey guys, today we'll be reading a book called My Dad Wears Polka Dotted Socks. You could see that the dad is wearing a polka dotted socks in the picture. Okay, let's get started. If you have this book, please read along. One day, my teacher, Miss Jenny, asked everyone in the class to draw a picture of their family to share at group time the following day. Seems like an easy assignment, right? No big deal, right? It wouldn't be if I had a normal family. You can see the boys, he's struggling because he doesn't have a normal family. And everyone else is just happy because they don't care. But I don't. My family is weird. When no one else is looking, we do strange things. In the morning, my dad sings while he's in the shower. Then he's breakfast wearing only his underwear and an orange polka dot his socks. When he comes from work, he changes into a silly outfit playing something called yoga all by himself in the front yard. I just know that one day the neighbors will see him. There's a dad wearing a polka dot socks and a dog and he's eating breakfast. And the boy is scared with his, and he's eating breakfast with his underwear. My mom likes to pretend that she is a ghost. At night time, she puts white slime all over her face and white gloves on her hands. Then she dresses up in a white gown before she gets in bed. She doesn't seem to care when no, none of us act scared. What's the point of being a ghost if you're not even scary? My sister Stella is three and a half years old. She is dark. Using a toy spoon, she scoops the dirt from my mom's garden and serves it to her dog. She always asks me if I'd like a spoonful. I ride and play yoga in my underwear. My big brother Chase is almost eight years old. He still takes his blanket to bed. When I'm seven, I'm donating my blanket to Stella. I'm probably the closest thing to normal in my house. But there was a one time when I dressed up in my mom's ghost outfit when she was out. But don't tell anyone. These are uh, these are some of my family's secrets. It gets worse. I have two dads, not one. The dad that lives with me, the dad I live with is my stepdad. My real dad lives somewhere else and visits me on the weekend. He does wild things like skydiving, bungee jumping, and scuba diving. My parents told me that since my half brother is on chase, my brother is only my half brother. He looks whole to me. I don't get it. Even my aunt and uncle, even my aunt and uncle are strange. My aunt Ruby wears black shiny clothes and smells like our car. When she gets here, she kisses me a thousand times once when once will be plenty. My uncle Brad thinks he's a pirate. He wears a patch on his eye and lives on a sailboat that doesn't even move away from the dock. What kind of person lives on a broken sailboat? I don't know what to do. I don't want to lie. But I can't tell my family secrets. The kids with, with normal families will think I'm weird too. Even though my mom is a bit kooky, I decided to ask her what she would do. She usually is good at helping me solve to solve problems. Honey, all families are different, she said. That's what makes them special. The next day at school, all the kids will sit fidgeting on the rug at group time with their drawing on their laps. Miss Jenny asks who wants to go first. Maggie raises her hand. Hi. She always volunteers to go first. Maggie skips out to the front of the class. She points to her drawing. Here's me. And here's my, here's my mom. And here's my dad. And here's my little brother. And here's my big sister. Then Maggie sits down. I knew it, my mom. My mom was wrong. Everyone in Maggie's picture is normal. No secrets. The kids clapped for Maggie. I slumped down into the rug. I figured that if I make myself as small as possible, then Jenny will forget to call me. Larry goes up next. He has a big bouncy grin. 
He did his drawing on a brown paper bag instead of a white paper. This is my mom. She does karate. Mom's on good with karate. I have two dads. My real dad is an opera singer. He has to wear makeup and funny costume when he sings. Makeup? Dad don't wear makeup. My stepdad is a writer. He writes scary books for grown-ups. And this is me in the middle. Sometimes I think that my family is real. My dad says that's what makes us special. Larry's family is not normal. It's not so normal. And he has two dads too, like me. The kids are all clapping, so I clap the loudest. The teacher looks around at all the kids on the rug. I slam down as small as I can. Miss Johnny, eyes stop at me. Hmm, Jake, would you like to go next? Here's the picture. She got a big head. <laughs> I stood up, up to the front. My heart is beating fast. What if the kids laugh? What if the teacher decides to send me home because she thinks that such a weird family should not be allowed in school? I hold my picture. I I hold my picture. I had to use two sheets of paper. My mom helped me take them together. This is my mom. She 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 takes care of me and my brother and my sister. This is my stepdad. He works hard all day at work. This is my real dad. He goes on he goes on a lot of adventures. This is my brother Chase. He almost he's almost eight and this is is my little sister Stella. She likes to play in the garden. Everyone is looking at me. The teacher is smiling. It is very quiet. I take a deep breath and pour out Uncle Brad. And this is my Uncle Brad. He lives on a boat in Rucker. I sit quietly hoping no one can hear. No one is laughing. I can't believe it. Cool, says Joey. The class bully. Says Joey, the class bully. Feeling brave, I speak. I a little louder. This is my Aunt Ruby. She rides with motorcycles and smells like gasoline. Maggie raises her hand. Yes, Maggie. Asks Miss Jenny. That's cool, your Aunt Ruby rides with motorcycles, says Maggie. Miss Jenny smiles. That's good. What a wonderful family you have. Everyone claps. Everyone that is except Billy. Billy raises his hand. Hi. Billy, do you want something to say? Asked Miss Jenny. Is your dad wearing polka dot and socks? He asked. I can feel my face turning bright red. I can I can stand trembling, trembling, waiting for the kids to laugh. Billy kept on speaking. And is your mom dressed up as like a goat? This is it. I am sure I'll be saying, mm, yes, I'm on. Billy smiles slowly. He hold up the picture of his family and the for the whole class to see. In the picture, his mom is dressed as the green goblin. Money tissue. Green goblin, and his dad is wearing po purple polka dotted socks. The and and there's a cool activity at the back. You get to write how the family special and all those stuff. Okay, if you like it, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button real hard. And if you want, and if you want me to do more stuff, I would like a puppet show or anything else. And I'm selling fidget spinners. Uh, see, I I just have one. I have more in my book bag. I'm selling them, and I would like to show you all of them probably next time. Okay, bye bye. It's a girl, Aisha, and Fatu the Sad.